guys, I am at City Mission and I found two awesome items. I'm gonna turn the camera around and show you. Not that I'm busy today. Um, I found this Ikebana. Awesome, awesome pottery Ikebana for $4.99. I'm definitely spending $5 on that. Look at the design and then the color, the glaze. All right, might as well look around. There is a, I was thinking that was Inky Candle. There, there's a cafe. What are these? Oh, look at that. Oh, I like those. They're a dollar each. Let me see. What is that? Is that just like a. I don't know what that is. <laughs> a dollar each. I love it though. And I don't know if I could do a dollar. It's not enough profit for me. Okay. That's Yankee, it's not Yankee Candle. There, there's an owl. Toothbrush holder, I'm not picking that. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna pick it up. Better homes. Oh, look at that. Right here. In the pond, maybe? It's footed for $2. I like that. Maybe I'll... I'm gonna think about it though. It's a porcelain and it's hand painted. What is this? Brainstorms. <laughs> what does that say? From 1987. That's pretty cool. For $3.99. Put it there though. I don't know what this is for. It's been here for a while. It's um, a school project or something. Yeah, the metal flower is still here. There's an eggplant. <laughs> oh, that one's wood. It's gonna stay there. Oh my gosh, I could go for a fried eggplant right now. Ooh. Plastic. I wonder if that's Lucite. No, that's too new. Yeah, let me see who made that. I don't know. Alright, eh, there's um, right done. Hmm, newer, but for five dollars. Maybe I shall look it up. There's a queen bee. These are brand new. Let me look it up quick. Not that much more, like $14, so it's gonna stay here. Fake milk glass. Look at this. Oh, look at this. Ooh, I like that. Look at the tulips and the turquoise. That's $4, so... E I think I'm gonna leave it. Right here is what I was coming for. Probably made in Japan. Ah, eh, $3.99. Alright, put that there. Fish. What is this? That's a big mug. <laughs> it's called mug. <laughs> uh, there's the, ooh, this one I might get for myself. I need like the milk glass Pyrex or Corel. We have a few of the spring blossom and now I have the golden butterfly. I get that for myself. What is that one? Oh, it looks like Batosi. So somebody donated all of their Raydon. Um, not worth too much. Already looked some of these up and um, like one of these sell for about $5.99. And then they have these. Queen hot cocoa iced tea. Yeah. Ooh, a cup. This one looks like Stangle. Oh, I'm gonna get it for two dollars. I'm pretty sure that's Stangle. The glaze is right. Do that. Notice this. I'm pretty sure it's a compact. Um, oh, it feels a little. I don't know. Is it cheap? <laughs> I'm gonna open it up. There is a number in there. Um, 
Should I get it for four dollars? Kind of like it. I could give it to Michael and he could do his makeup. <laughs> I don't know, I gotta think about that. So these are the two that I gotta think about. Flower basket down here. It's a hat box. Alright, that's from Marshall's, but so Marshall sometimes has good stuff. Like they have Mexican pottery, um, Talavera. Alright, that's nothing, so I'm gonna put it back there. Well, I am at Captain's Treasures. Um, I decided I had to leave City Mission. Um, I found these. These are a set of seven for ten dollars. Look, you get the fork, spoons, salt and pepper, oil and vinegar, and the bowl. So it'll only be five bucks. Everything's half off. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. <laughs> All right, let's look this over and I'm sure it's worth picking up. I'm not sure who made these. Just carrying huh. this in. This napkin holder. Oh, Christmas tree shop. That's pretty. I like the blue. And that has the rooster. This copper. I'm trying to slow down a little bit. I think I was going too fast. I'm, oh, in my last few videos. So I'm trying to slow down. That's just the way I am. I go fast. <laughs> Waiting for it to clear out. Um, oh, I wanted to look at this. Looks German. For two fifty isn't bad. All right, here is a ornament, a hand blown ornament. Oh, it's a margarita. <laughs> no, it's not. It's a I don't know. I see a lime. Yeah, I'll leave that. Silver, maybe. I don't think it's sterling. Candle holders. Here are cute. The little fair. Are these fairies? Oh, it's left in Japan. Three seventy-five for the pair. Three seventy-five. I like them. Says the antique ivory KW. That's always the uh, model number. I think I'm gonna get these. I don't see any damage. I like the the dress with the flowers and the flower on the head. Yeah, I'm gonna put these. I'm gonna put it in the whole table. <laughs> right there. A fresh cart. I just yelled at really loud. <laughs> Okay, a lot of bugs, young world. I don't know how much the bugs are. This is neat. Huh, four, that'd be two. That's newer. I don't know if somebody already picked through this. Or was that the one that was over there? Never mind. Alright, let's turn around and look at the candle section. Nothing really here. Same stuff that I'm seeing. Okay, no glassy baby or lucite, nope. Fairy lamps, that was the other thing. Fairy lamps around here are like, I can't, I can never find them. Nothing hiding back there. Basket. It's pretty. I want to see this, I see something shiny. Oh, okay, it's just a... Uh, that's a candle holder. I think. You put a candle in the middle. Whatever you want to do with it, actually. <laughs> okay, let's go over here. These mugs are interesting. Applause. Uh, here's some cup and saucers. Oh, jeez. To make glue to scare the heck out of me. I thought it was going to fall all over. I always like the green with the gold. It kind of reminds me of um, the Vanderbelts and the Breakers. They had ones with peacocks. I forget the name. It was a pattern. It was beautiful though. It's yellow and it has the peacock birds all around it. It's like, oh my gosh, I want that. It's 
swizzle sticks. These glass. Those are plastic. Those say they're a glass. I may get them. I mean, they're only a dollar. I just don't see too much value in it. It'd be something I would take forever to sell. In Japan, these are. I like these that they're small. Hmm. I mean, missing the lid, but. Pie dish. Ooh, look at this pottery. Oh, I've seen this here last time. Clay Tactic Designs. That'd be four dollars. Hmm. Put that there. It's ceramic. Usually this is wood. Decoration. General Electric, but that's in Schenectady. That's near us. Like ten minutes from us. <laughs> Oh wow. Thermostat, that's cast iron. It'll be a dollar fifty. I'm gonna get this. A lighthouse. I decided to just put it in for a dollar fifty and take a chance. Always a name. Definitely gonna research though. Nothing hiding under here. What are these? Fancy This is a glass where you drink with your pinky up. <laughs> Something. Oh, champagne. Ooh, that is a glass. Okay, that is one you put your pinky up. All right, over here, I gotta show everybody. Let me slowly turn all of this Waterford crystal. I think that's the Lismore. Um, they'd be $10 each, though, so I can't do it. I can't do it. See how, um, see they notice the Waterford mark. Uh, they even have the candlesticks. I'm not sure that pattern. Now some of them I don't even think they have. Avon um, sent me something. Um, they're not always marked and they don't always have a pattern name. So it's hard to learn all the patterns when there isn't any. But that's a Lismore box. Carefully take that out. See if there's any markings. I think they're just like a generic glass mirror. Alright, what about this gravy? That looks fancy too. Look at all the crazing. Um, look at the under plate. I like the shape of it. Oh, no markings. I'm surprised. Okay, I'm gonna leave it with the damage and the gold loss. Yeah. Vino. <laughs> I think that's Dansk Gourmet. Um, I still have these Dansk cup and saucers. I like the brown. They'd be two fifty each. I just, maybe I should just get them. I was just looking up sold comps again. They only go for about $10 each set. So it's $2.50. I'm not going to do it. That's why they're still, that's why I keep leaving them. These are pretty cool. Okay, this is newer carnival glass. You can see how I'm if it was antique, it would be heavy. The carnival glass would be heavy. Ooh, look at those. Oh, fancy glasses. These are cool. I like the handle and then the basket weave. A dollar. Some spode. Ooh, look at these. Look, the Santa Claus is on the top. Okay, there's a set of two. I'm gonna get these. All right, let's see about the mugs. That is not. Hmm. I mean, it's probably not the right time to pick up Christmas spode, but why not? I don't find it too much. Anything hiding back here? Where's Michael? I'm kidding. <laughs> These are neat. Kind of waiting for them to bring more stuff out. These are neat. They're um juice glasses. That's a big juice glass. Yeah, that's an orange, orange slice. I found this 
lot of ribbon. Um, it would only be a dollar fifty. Spool or ribbon? It's kind of like a mix. I'm pretty sure most of these are used, but since it's a lot, I feel like I could get. I could definitely make money off that, especially if I lot them together. Oh, I also found this silk scarf. Even has the name on the bottom, which makes me think it's a little bit higher quality. But look at the flower. It's 100% silk, too. Look at the flower. Look how pretty. I wonder if Michael will take it and wear it. Um, I just have to make sure there is no damage. Silk tear is very easy. Uh, there's plenty of times where I bought some and they were torn up when I brought them home. Wait, let me put this in. I'm pretty sure that's Laurel Birch. Oh yeah, it is. Wait, would it, wouldn't it be marked? Is there a signature anywhere? Ah, I feel like it would be marked. Um, hmm. So weird. All the ones I'm seeing online are um, filled on the back where it's smooth and this has a texture and it's not signed. A little different. It's signed on the back with the uh, model name. I am not seeing anything else. This is everything I'm getting. All right, so my total spend was around $12 at City Mission and I believe 16 at Captain's Treasures. Um, first item is this brass made in India tidbit tray. I'm not sure what they use this for, if it's missing another tray. because it looks like it turns I'm not sure, but I like it. It has enamel and it's signed. It has a sticker, um, India. So I think I could get about $35 for this. All right, up next is the Cast Iron Lighthouse. This look awesome in a beach house. I only spent $1.50. I'm going to list this for $34.99 on eBay. All right, and next I have this awesome pottery Ikebana. I love the shape of this. It's so different from... Uh, other ones that I usually find where it's just flat. Um, this one is signed on the bottom. I'm not sure. I paid $5 and I'm thinking about $26 for this. Alright, in this awesome vintage salad bowl set, um, you get the bowl, the spoon and fork, salt and pepper, and oil and vinegar. I almost feel like this is a Blue Ridge. Um, it has that design. It just has that look. So I have a Blue Ridge reference book at home. I'm going to search through it. That's how I learn a lot of stuff. Um, I like look through a book more than on the internet. All right, then the left and figurines, the cute little fairies, or that's not a fairy, it's a ballerina. Um, I probably could have left these behind. There's no sold comps for it. And then this one, the flower is broken off right by the foot and on the top. Um, I'm not sure how that broke off, but I don't think I'm going to list it now. <laughs> All right, well, that is it for now. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and check out my eBay store and the Thrifting Twins eBay store. We have links in the description. And then uh, tomorrow is my whatnot sale. Um, I have, uh, also have a link in the description to get $15 off your first purchase sign-up. You can't be signed up already. And I will see everybody next time. Bye.